Hello students, so continuing our lectures on uh, electronic uh, devices. Uh, we'll first start with uh, arranging the following uh, materials. We have uh, gold, we have germanium, and we have uh, glass. We will arrange this following material in terms of uh, increasing order of resistivity. Please rho, and uh, we know that R resistance is equal to rho L by A. Now, since uh, uh, so this is a metal this is a semiconductor and this is a dielectric or insulated so since the metal is highly conducting so the resistivity of gold is will be the lowest it should be followed by the resistivity of the semiconductor germanium followed by the resistivity of the glass in insulator having the highest resistivity now the second uh, thing is that when we are uh, bringing uh, two atomic orbitals namely uh, psi 1 is A and psi 1 is B we bring them and they combine to form two molecular orbitals So that means if uh, it is an uh, addition that is then we form something called a bonding molecular orbital given as sigma however if there is a subtraction then it's an anti-bonding molecular orbital given as sigma star now if there are uh, two metals a and b they are uh, two metals having resistivity uh, metal A is having resistivity is uh, 16 uh, a resistance not resistivity so we can write R A as equal to uh, 16 nano ohms and Rv is equal to 56 nano ohms and the radius and the, in the area of the metal B is twice the radio area of metal A so that means uh, dA is equal to uh, no, not the area but the diameter diameter of one of the metal is twice that of the other metal so since area is uh, pi r square uh, we can write it as a pi d square by 4 and we all know that rho l by a is equal to r so we can write A by R B is equal to uh, rho A by rho B uh, into it will be uh, DB by DA whole square. So 
so that will uh, so uh, we know that 1 by RA by RB is only 16 and there is uh, 56 rho A by rho B and since T A is equal to 2 A B so it will be 1 by 4 so we can write uh, uh, rho A by rho B is equal to uh, 4 into 16 by 56 so that makes it 1 sorry so that makes it uh, 16 by 14 so this is the ratio of the resistivity of the two metals Now, uh, when n atomic orbitals uh, they overlap in a metal. Overlap uh, they form n molecular orbitals. And these n molecular orbitals they have. Uh, N energy states and each energy state can accommodate two electron each so it implies that they can accommodate uh, two N electrons can be accommodated Coming to a molecule helium. H E uh, two. So this molecule, it cannot form H uh, E two. This is an hypothetical molecule. H E two cannot form. That means uh, two H atoms cannot come closer to form a bond between them and form an H2 molecule. This is not possible. Uh, the reason uh, is because uh, out of uh, we know that there are four electrons uh, in H2, four electrons in H2. So in fact, two electrons in HE. So when we talk about HE plus HE, HE two, uh, so it will be there will be uh, four electrons. Uh, so out of these four electrons, uh, two electrons will occupy uh, the bonding orbital. That is sigma. That is two electrons will occupy the antibody orbital. Two will occupy the antibonding orbital. That is sigma star. So when this happens, uh, we'll have a situation where the higher we'll have an a higher overall energy of the H2 molecule than the energy of the two individual atoms. So, an higher overall energy of the 
H E two uh, molecule. Than the energy of the two individual atoms. Hence, uh, H2 molecule cannot form. Secondly, the stability and the energy of the molecule orbital decreases as increase uh, as in, uh, as increase as uh, right, rather we should put the as the energy of the molecule orbital increases uh, M O so it causes the stability to decrease. Now, if we increase the number of modes, the stability will go down, the energy will increase, the stability again go down as vice versa. Now the probability of an electron occupying an energy a level of uh, so the probability of an electron occupying an energy level of uh, 0 0.01 electron volt above the point level uh, is at, at 300 K. And 500 k are given as of our expression. The probability is uh, uh, specifically f of e to one by uh, e to the power e minus e f by k t plus one. So this is. This happens to be the difference in energy. This is delta E, and this is equal to 0 0.01 electron volt. And uh, at uh, 300 Kelvin, the KT corresponds to uh, 0 0.0259 electron volts. At uh, 500 Kelvin, KT corresponds to uh, 0 0.04 oh. electron volts. So we put the values here. The probability uh, of the Fe turns out to be uh, 0 0.4 at uh, 300 K and uh, 0 0.44 at 500 K. Density of states is another concept. Number of uh, electrons per number of uh, particles per energy. That is called density of states. TOS and density of states uh, is found to be increasing as uh, root over e.